Hello and welcome to Martin Maths. We're looking at Maths GCC papers and this is the 2023 actual foundation paper one from the May series and I'm just going through each question in the paper. Here we've got to write 38% as a decimal. Percent means uh, out of 100. So that is going to be 0 0.38. Okay, that's the tens and that's the units uh, moved into decimals. Okay, uh, tenths and then hundredths, sorry, I meant to say. All right, what fraction of the shape is shaded? Well, there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten squares, uh, square triangles, and three out of ten are shaded. One, two, three shaded there. Okay, and it says here is a list of numbers, and from the list write down the smallest number. Okay, well, if we look at the first place value of the units, 2.1 would be the biggest, but they want the smallest. It's going to be 0 0.5. Then work out minus 9 plus 5. Think of the number line. There's 0, there's minus 9. Adding 5 is going that way. So it's going to end up at minus 87654. Minus 4. Okay, you could have thought about that as 5 minus 9. Okay, so just quickly going over that percentage to decimal, uh, you just m move the numbers through the decimal place by 100. Fractions, the number of parts shaded out of the total. The smallest number, look at the uh, first place value, which is the units, and those three have got all one in them, so that one's zero, and then imagine a number line when we're doing that one. So let's look at two more that we can do. I'm trying to go for a mark a minute, but early part of the paper should be able to do quite a lot. Solve p minus two equal to three. Now we can do the balance method, but sometimes I think, just think about this in your numbers. What take away two equals three? Well, five take away two is three. So yes, you can use the balance method and add two on both sides, but I'd rather just turn it into English or uh, almost like a primary maths. Okay, so it'd be 5. And just check your answer, 5 minus 2 is 3. And then here we have um, some labels on a circle that Freddy's added. He's put that as the diameter, that is the circumference, and that is the center. That's correct. That's correct. But that is not. That should be the radius. The diameter would go all the way through. So the diameter should reach circumference on both sides, or something like that. Okay, or the radius of that, that should give us the mark. Okay, so I've managed to do six questions in just a couple of minutes. Percentage to decimal, fractions, number, more number, bit of algebra, and then circles. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share, and good luck for those writing exams.